China just shocked the world. With what it's building, while many nations spend hundreds of billions of dollars on wars and weapons, China is using that same amount of money to build the future. Not with bombs, but with breathtaking marvels of technology and infrastructure. Massive creations reshaping the earth and redefining how people live, move, and connect. From the world's largest radio telescope, the FAST, with a diameter of 1,640 feet, to the Yantai Dalian undersea tunnel stretching 76 miles, and the Medog Hydropower Dam in the Himalayas. Three times larger than the Three Gorges Dam. These are not just feats of engineering, but symbols of a nation that believes in the power of intelligence over war. Welcome back to China Discoveries Official. I'm James, your host today. Join me as we explore the $100 billion mega projects where China is not only building a nation, but building the future of humanity. The Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge, the longest sea bridge in the world. In the middle of the South China Sea, a colossal structure has redrawn the transportation map of Asia. The Hong Kong Zhuhai Macau Bridge, stretching 34 miles, is the longest sea crossing in the world, combining bridges, undersea tunnels, and two man made islands a new symbol of modern engineering. With a budget exceeding 20 billion US dollars and a decade of construction, the project endured more than 500 typhoons and ocean waves reaching 33 feet high, connecting Hong Kong, Zhuhai, and Macau, the core of the Greater Bay Area, home to over 80 million people, and a combined GDP of 1.9 trillion US dollars each year. This bridge not only shortens the distance between three cities, but also embodies the power of infrastructure in China's 21st century vision, where humanity does not simply cross oceans, but redefines its own limits. Shanghai Tower. With a total construction cost exceeding 15.7 billion yuan, or about 2.4 billion US dollars, the Shanghai Tower is not only the tallest building in China, but also one of the most expensive skyscraper projects in the world. Standing 2,074 feet tall with 128 floors, it required more than 500,000 tons of steel, 2 million cubic meters of concrete, and foundations reaching 300 feet deep, capable of withstanding magnitude 9 earthquakes and category 12 typhoons. Rising from the vibrant financial heart of Shanghai, the colossal twisting tower stands among other skyscrapers like a ribbon of steel and glass spiraling into the sky. Each curve is precisely engineered to reduce wind pressure by 24%, giving the impression that the building itself is gently turning in the air. Its double glass facade functions as a massive environmental system, saving 21% of energy and making the Shanghai Tower one of the greenest buildings on the planet. Inside, it is a vertical city featuring shopping centers, offices, hotels, indoor gardens, and the world's highest observation deck. Elevators travel at 46 miles per hour, lifting visitors into the clouds within seconds. If Dubai's Burj Khalifa symbolizes luxury and America's One World Trade Center stands as a monument to resilience, then the Shanghai Tower represents intelligence and vision, where technology, art, and China's aspirations for the future unite as one. Beijing Daxing International Airport. Covering an area of 700,000 square meters, equal to 100 football fields, the Beijing Daxing International Airport, designed by Zaha Hadid Architects, is the largest airport in China and a symbol of 21st century aviation. Inspired by the shape of a five-armed starfish, Daxing reflects China's spirit of connection, integration, and global vision. The airport can handle 100 million passengers and 620,000 flights per year, with a total investment of more than 17 billion US dollars. Built over five years by 40,000 engineers and workers, it features an AI-powered flight management system a high-speed rail link that connects to central Beijing in just 20 minutes, and advanced facial recognition and automated baggage systems that transform it into a true smart aviation city. 
When night falls, the airport's vast dome of steel and glass glows like a giant star on the ground, announcing that the aviation hub of the 21st century now shines brightly in the east. The Beijing-Guangzhou High-Speed Railway. With a budget exceeding 234 billion US dollars, the Beijing-Guangzhou High-Speed Railway, stretching 1,428 miles, is one of the most expensive and complex transportation projects ever built. The line passes through six provinces in 80 cities, serving as the backbone of the world's largest high-speed rail network. Silver CR400A trains race along the track at 217 miles per hour, cutting travel time from more than 22 hours down to only eight, crossing thousands of bridges and tunnels that reach hundreds of feet deep underground. The project consumed more than 60 million tons of steel and hundreds of millions of tons of concrete, a testament to China's extraordinary engineering capability. At night, the bright high-speed trains streak across the dark land like arrows of light connecting the northern and southern ends of the nation. While many countries are still debating the costs and designs, China has already completed over 28,000 miles of high-speed rail, enough to circle the Earth more than once. The South North Water Transfer Project. China's South North Water Transfer Project is the largest water diversion project in the world. Originating from an idea proposed by Mao Zedong in 1952 to solve the problem of too much water in the south and too little in the north, the plan was designed to secure water resources for the capital Beijing and dozens of industrial cities across northern China. Three massive canal routes, the eastern, central, and western lines, stretch for more than 2,000 miles, transferring about 36 billion cubic yards of water each year from the Yangtze River to the arid northern regions. The central route, spanning over 900 miles, has been completed and now supplies water to more than 40 cities, including Beijing, Tianjin, and Henan province. The project required advanced engineering technology, including a canal section built beneath the Yellow River, one of the most complex hydraulic constructions ever attempted. The total investment is estimated to exceed 80 billion US dollars, spanning multiple decades and involving millions of workers. Today, southern waters flow into reservoirs, parks, and factories in the north, sustaining the daily lives of more than 120 million people. This is not just a hydraulic project, but a powerful demonstration of China's organizational capability, long-term vision, and engineering strength in reshaping the natural balance of an entire nation. The Medog Hydropower Project. The Medog Hydropower Station, a project three times larger than the Three Gorges Dam and located deep in the Himalayas, is the largest energy construction ever attempted by humankind. With a capacity of 60 gigawatts, Medog is expected to generate 300 billion kilowatt hours of electricity each year, enough to power more than 100 million households. The project carries an estimated investment of 200 billion yuan, or about 28 billion US dollars. It was approved at the end of 2024, began construction in July 2025, and is scheduled for completion in 2033. Situated at the Great Bend of the Yarlung Shangpo River, at an elevation of more than three miles amid steep, rugged terrain, it is one of the most challenging construction sites on Earth. Chinese engineers are building five cascading dams and drilling 56 miles of diversion tunnels at depths of nearly 5,000 feet, working in temperature differences of 72 degrees Fahrenheit and seismic risks reaching magnitude 8. More than 20,000 engineers and workers, together with 15-meter tunnel boring machines and real-time geological sensors, are being deployed to ensure absolute precision. Once completed, the Medog Hydropower Station will produce twice the combined output of the Grand Coulee and Hoover Dams in the United States. Standing as a symbol of China's technological power and its unyielding determination to conquer nature. Fast Telescope, the 500-meter aperture telescope. Compared to America's Arecibo Observatory, once a symbol of Western scientific pride, 
China's fast is two and a half times larger and three times more sensitive, making it the largest radio telescope in the world. Located in a limestone valley in Guizhou province, FAST has a diameter of 1,640 feet, equal to 30 football fields, and is built inside a natural depression perfectly shaped to collect radio waves. Its structure is made up of 4,400 aluminum panels, forming a giant parabolic surface that can adjust by millimeters to capture signals as weak as 10 to the power of minus 14 watts, smaller than the energy released when a single snowflake hits the ground. The ultra-precise control system allows FAST to scan the sky with extraordinary accuracy, detecting radio pulses from pulsars, signals from distant galaxies, and helping scientists study the origins of gravitational waves. Operational since 2020, FAST represents not only a technological milestone, but also a symbol of China's scientific capability marking a new era in exploring the universe through radio astronomy. The Sichuan Tibet Railway. The Sichuan Tibet Railway is one of China's greatest engineering miracles, a project that pushes the limits of what is possible in extreme natural conditions. Stretching about 1,012 miles, it traverses what engineers call the three extremes, extreme altitude, extreme seismic activity, and extreme geological complexity. More than 74% of the route consists of tunnels and bridges, including mountain tunnels stretching for dozens of miles, drilled under immense rock pressure and severe temperature differences. To maintain a design speed of 100 to 124 miles per hour across the high plateau, engineers develop frost-resistant rails, special elastic tracks that prevent cracking from thermal expansion, and a real-time seismic monitoring system. Steel bridges rising hundreds of feet span deep canyons, such as the Dadu and Jinsha rivers, appearing like silver threads suspended in the sky. The project employs large diameter tunnel boring machines, ultra high strength concrete, and AI driven algorithms that optimize progress and safety hour by hour. The railway reduces travel time from Chengdu to Lhasa to around 10 to 12 hours opening a new economic and tourism corridor across the Tibetan plateau and proving China's ability to lay tracks where it once seemed impossible. The Yantai Dalian Undersea Railway Tunnel. Beneath the deep waters of the Bahai Strait, China is planning one of the most ambitious engineering projects in history, the Yantai Dalian Undersea Railway Tunnel also known as the Bohai Strait Tunnel Project. When completed, it will become the longest undersea tunnel in the world, stretching 123 kilometers, far surpassing both Japan's Seikin Tunnel and the Channel Tunnel connecting Britain and France. The project is expected to cut travel time from eight hours to just 40 minutes, as high-speed trains traveling at 155 miles per hour race beneath the ocean floor linking the two strategic port cities of Yantai in Shandong and Dalian in Liaoning. At present, the journey between these two points requires a detour of more than 930 miles or several hours by ferry, with an estimated cost of 300 billion yuan or about 43 billion US dollars. The construction will consume millions of tons of steel and concrete, equal to dozens of Golden Gate bridges combined. More than 15,000 engineers will take part in the project, operating tunnel boring machines with diameters of nearly 50 feet under extreme depth and pressure. The Baha'i Strait lies atop two major seismic fault lines, forcing engineers to develop the world's most advanced earthquake and flood-resistant technologies. Additionally, challenges such as ventilation, drainage, and ensuring a material lifespan of more than 100 years make this one of the most demanding construction efforts ever undertaken. The Solar Highway Project. In Shandong province, China stunned the world by building the first road on earth that can generate its own electricity. The road surface is paved with ultra durable solar panels covered by a transparent polymer layer strong enough to withstand 10-ton trucks driving over it every day. 
Each kilometer of roadway can produce about 1 million kilowatt hours of electricity per year, enough to power 800 homes, while also charging electric vehicles on the move and providing fully automated nighttime lighting. Beneath the surface, thermal sensors, AI cameras, and electromagnetic coils allow self-driving cars to communicate with the road itself, receiving traffic signals, collision warnings, and instant weather updates. When expanded, China's highway network will no longer just be transportation infrastructure, but a massive energy grid, turning every meter of pavement into a solar panel that powers the nation. This is more than an engineering breakthrough, it is a statement. While the world debates clean energy, China is transforming the very ground it drives on into a solar power plant. If you were impressed by any of these engineering wonders, leave a comment below and subscribe to China Discoveries Official so you won't miss the incredible stories ahead. I'm James and I'll see you on our next journey of discovery.